Also love this next segment. We're talking all things crafts. Halloween is next week, so to celebrate, we're learning how to make some creepy but also very cute crafts. Joy Shimabukuro, creative director at HouseSmart Ben Franklin Crafts, joins us for all the fun. Good morning. Hello. Okay, so happy to have you back because you have the <laughs> best ideas. And looking at this, what we have in front of us, well, we love so good. Being, you know, we love sharing with you because we know you like to craft too. Yes, yeah, so Great. fun. Okay, so what do you have for us today? So really quick, we have these. Okay. These are like our deco mesh wreaths that we brought before, and you just kind of make it. Mm -hmm. But the cool thing is we have these Halloween kits that you can just stick these little characters in, and you're done. So we got the witch's legs, which kind of dangle. Yes, how cute is this? And then see how simple this is? See and how so you just it stuff it in there. Yeah, you and just if you, stuff it in. Perfect. And if you guys have missed our last segment, make sure you head on over to cage12.com. We have all of our old crafts, but she actually taught us how to make these wreaths, and it's actually pretty simple. It is. It's very easy, to right? To make your own wreath. Amazing. Right. So well, cute. Well, I want to show you this. This is like a recycled craft. At our yeah. office, our office likes to craft too. Of course. So <laughs> we, had a, we have a Halloween thing going on, and last week we had a contest to make a craft okay. with a recycled item. So Gina here filled the bottle with the little water beads, and she just added some wa um, oh, food coloring yeah. to turn it orange. That's but you see, is. she put um, a black tape and then we have these little lights, and they're really cool because you can change what they do. <gasps> so cute. And it's a little jack-o'-lantern. this is first place. Ooh. This was made by Estra, and you can tell it's the big bottles. Oh, that's right? the bottom of a bottle. Right, and the top. Ah. And then she used the part that she cut out to make the leaves. How cute So the is kids that? can make this. Maybe, you know, parents got to help cut it for Wait, them. Even this was part of the bottle. Yeah, it's oh. that part. Isn't My that goodness. cool? That so is so cool. clever. And so I clever. love this too because not only are you having fun doing a cute craft with your cakey, but also mm -hmm. teaching them the importance of recycling and right. reusing and reusing. Mm -hmm. This is a perfect way to reuse. How cute! I know. I just love it, right? So yes, this was made by Estra. Then we have simple crafts, and we do have project sheets for for our hoop kitty. So cute. Hoop kitty is super easy. Just get a piece of cardstock and fold it into the ears. Wrap it with the um, yarn. And put the ears on first, oh, yeah. then go completely around with the yarn. Okay. So this will keep them entertained for a while. All right, <laughs> wonderful. And, and how do you do? You stick that on? Do you glue it, or can you well, just? you can just tie it. Just I tie just it. tied it. And okay. I, what I recommend is do short lengths at a time, because this is kind of hard to go. You know, especially if you live with cats, they oh. love getting to the top. <laughs> then we have really simple things like, okay, if you want to get a little spooky but not super spooky, you could just take this skull jar and fill it with candy. Or if you want, you can fill it with water beads again. Water that's beads. colored. And yeah. so when you she colored this, you said it's just this food one was coloring? just this is just red food coloring. Oh, so you could put purple or green, yeah, anything could, to make yeah. it and of whatever course, color you want. Yeah. Just remember so that when you're working with these, make sure that the kids don't put them in their mouth. Right. Right. Okay. So that's that. So cute and so simple. And of course, this can also go on the light and it'll yeah. glow too. So Love this that. is really fun. So something like this is already made. And, and at Ben Franklin's, do you have... Yes, and actually skulls? things like this, Halloween and fall is 30% off right now. Ooh, so score. So go and get your stuff. But here's another project that we have a project sheet. This is so cute. It's so simple. It's just felt. And we have little felt ghosts. And we made little candy corns. Just All really right. simple. And for fun, we added eyes. And then you can play tic-tac-toe. I absolutely love this. How cute is that? So when you make this, though... It, I mean, to me, when I first look at this, this looks complex, but when you think about <laughs> no. it, you really just glued on some ribbon and right. got some felt and stuck it together. What That's do you right. use, hot glue or? I use hot glue for this because I want to do it fast. Okay. But the kids can use the tacky glue. It'll just take a little bit longer to dry. Okay. And again, we have a project sheet for the shapes and the how-tos. So it's really easy. You know, it's fun that they can actually make their Halloween activities yes. as well as, you know, and the other thing is, you know, this could easily be a pin. Exactly. Right. So, so cute. Or tie it onto your treat bag or I something like that. that. Okay. See how easy? And this is something that's so cute too because once it's actually made, you know, it's fun making it. But then mm -hmm. also you have a fun Halloween game too. Right. I you can even that. change these out later. I mean, depending on what you put, but you can change it out for other occasions and, you know, pick like for Easter, pick an egg and a bunny or something. Okay. And just keep yes. making them. That is such a good idea. I love this. Okay, so I feel like the, you, obviously the bead ones are kind of more self-explanatory, right? Mm -hmm. But how, do you, how did she actually create she, this? So this is actually the, like a, maybe a two-liter bottle. Okay. And then you cut the bottom so you can tell this is the bottom part. Okay, yeah, yeah. And then this is the top. 
So basically, you might want to draw a line. So that's why I said that parents might have to help yeah. cut that initial part. And so maybe the bottle's like this high. Mm -hmm. So you got all that space in between that you can cut your leaves out of. Okay. And then how do you, uh, I guess, put the t that together? You is can, that glue or is that... You, you can either glue it down. And I think she glued it down. Okay. Well, actually, it can come out. See? <gasps> oh! And you can put it's your put treat. It's put together. Yeah. Oh, how cute is that? So you can fill this with candy and give this as your little treat. That is adorable. I thought it was glued together. <laughs> well, I guess some, you know, you can, but you can make it as a treat. Brilliant. I love it. Your ideas yes, are always yes. the best. So oh. give credit to Esther for yes, this one. and Esther for this one. I love <laughs> it. Well, thank you so much for joining us. Yes. Super cute Halloween crafts that, again, you guys can do at home with your cakey.